On Monday, Indonesia's Mount Levutobi Laki Laki erupted, unleashing a towering column of ash and volcanic material that climbed as high as 18 kilometers into the sky. This comes just weeks after a June eruption prompted officials to raise the volcano's alert status to its highest level. Indonesia is home to over 120 active volcanoes, more than in any other country. Mount Leotobi Laki Laki sits on Flores Island, part of Indonesia's notorious ring of fire, a chain of over 450 volcanoes lining the Pacific Ocean. Here, the Indo-Australian plate slides under the Eurasian plate, melting rock into magma and fueling one of the most volcanically active regions on Earth. The initial column of hot clouds that rose at 5 minutes past 11 am on Monday erupted again at 7.30 in the evening on the same day, followed by a third time at 5.53 am on Tuesday at a reduced intensity. The eruptions on Monday blanketed nearby villages in ash, disrupted daily life and forced dozens of flights to be cancelled. Fortunately, zero casualties were reported. Mount Laki Laki had also erupted in November 2024 when a similar blast killed nine people and injured dozens. Stratovolcanoes like Leotobi Laki Laki are built from layers of hardened lava, ash, and rock. Over time, magma rises and gets trapped beneath the surface. Pressure builds silently until the crater can no longer contain it. Monday's eruptions were the result of accumulation of energy due to a blockage of magma in the crater. This reduced detectable seismic activity while building up pressure. Hadi Vijaya, head of the Center for Volcanology and Geological Disaster Mitigation said, With nowhere to go, energy accumulated deep underground while seismic signals dropped. The silence was deceptive until everything blew wide open. Officials say, this eruption was one of the largest in Indonesia since Mount Merapi exploded in 2010, killing over 350 people and displacing hundreds of thousands. As a result of these week's eruptions, the exclusion zone around the crater has been doubled to 7 kilometers. Authorities are warning residents to stay away as more eruptions are likely. They also warned of potential Laha floods, a type of mud or debris flow of volcanic materials if heavy rain occurs.